Hello, this is Primary School Made Easy and in this video we're looking at fractions and subtraction when we have common denominators. Here's our first problem. One, take away two fifths. Now we know that one is the same as five fifths. And we're dealing with fifths. So our answer will be in fifths as well. Here's our whole chopped into five equal pieces. Five fifths. And we're going to take two of those pieces away. There we go. What do we have left? We have three fifths. Five fifths take away two fifths. And there's the sum we did. Five take away two is three fifths. And we know that five fifths is the same as one. So one take away two fifths is three fifths. Let's look at another problem. One take away six sevenths is what? And we know that one is the same as seven sevenths. Seven sevenths in a whole and our answer will be in sevenths. So there's our whole chopped into seven equal pieces. And we're going to take six of them away. What do we have left? We have one seventh. Seven sevenths take away six sevenths. It's one seventh. And the sum we actually do, seven take away six, because our denominators stay the same. And we know that seven sevenths is the same as one. So one take away six sevenths is one seventh. Let's have a look at the next one. One take away three eighths. We know that one is the same as eight eighths. And here's our whole chopped into eight equal pieces. And we're going to take three of them away. What will we have left? We have five eighths left. Eight eighths take away three eighths is five eighths. And if we write it out again, we can see the sum we did. Eight take away three equals five. And we know that eight eighths is the same as one. So one take away three eighths is five eighths. What about one take away five twelfths? Now we're dealing with twelfth, so we know that there are twelve twelfths in one. Here's our whole cut into 12 equal pieces. And we're going to take five of them away and see what we have left. We have seven twelfths left. Let's look at the sum we actually did. 12 take away 5 equals 7. And if we change the 12 twelfths back into 1, we can see that 1 take away 5 twelfths is 7 twelfths. Three sixths take away 1 sixth 
3 take away 1 is 2 sixths. 9 tenths take away 4 tenths is how many tenths? 9 take away 4 is 5 tenths. 1 take away 8 twelfths. Now we know that 1 is the same as 12 twelfths, so we can write this sum out. 12 twelfths take away 8 twelfths is how many twelfths? 12 take away 8 is 4. 1 take away 7 ninths and we know that 1 is the same as 9 ninths so we can write this sum out 9 ninths take away 7 ninths is how many ninths and the sum we do is just 9 take away 7 equals 2. Well done! Thank you for watching and I'll see you again soon.